Are you optimizing your website for voice search? Well, if not, you're gonna wanna start. People are using digital assistants like Google and Alexa to do voice searches every single day. By 2020, 50% of all searches will be voice. So with that in mind, I wanna give you seven tips to put into use so you can optimize your website for voice search SEO. Tip number one, find voice search keywords. When you do keyword research, you wanna look for longer terms. Look for these longer keywords by taking your main keyword and in putting it into your keyword research tools. You can mine for these uh, longer variations, these natural language keywords using a tool like Answer the Public or Uber Suggest, where you can actually plug in your main keyword and look for those longer variations and questions that would be more associated with voice. Tip number two, optimize your content for voice search. People typically will use voice search when they want to find a quick answer to something they want to know. Knowing that, you can take advantage of those voice search keywords you found by plugging them into your content. One way you can do this is by structuring uh, your article as an FAQ. Put those question keywords that people are actually asking as a heading in your piece and provide the answer right below it. Structuring your content like that makes it easier for Google to see that you're providing an answer to the question being asked. You can also just sprinkle those answers and questions throughout your content rather than use them as headings. Tip number three, optimize for featured snippets. Brian Dean did a study of voice search results and he found that more than 40% of voice search results came from a featured snippet. Now, if you don't know what a featured snippet is, a featured snippet is that little box that shows up at the top of some search results and it beats all the other results. To improve your odds of landing in the featured snippet and showing up as a voice search result, you wanna use structured data in your content. You want to use structured data like headings, bulleted lists, numbered lists, tables, and schema markup, which will indicate to Google that there's data in your piece and help Google crawl through, pull the information out of that, and place it in a featured snippet. And that is going to improve your chances to rank in a voice search result. Tip number four, try ranking video content. Google knows that when you do a voice search for how do I cut a pineapple, you'd rather see a video of somebody doing it than read about how to cut a pineapple. Knowing that, try to rank your video content. Optimize it for SEO with your titles, with tags, and with a detailed video description to improve the odds of Google pulling up your video in the featured snippet and presenting it as a voice search result. Tip number five, optimize for local voice searches. When you optimize for local search, it makes it easier for your customers to find you. So when a customer uses their voice search to look for a flower shop near me, Google is actually gonna pull up the closest flower shop that's actually near that person. So if you haven't yet, Fill out your Google My Business profile with as much information as you can, being sure to list what type of business it is. That way, when somebody does a local search, blank near me, you will be the one to show up and you will get those customers. Tip number six, raise your website's domain authority. This is a very, very important factor in ranking for voice search results. Google wants to provide results from authority sites, so be a leader in your niche and raise your domain authority to improve the odds of your answers showing up in Google. If you don't have high domain authority, build it up by getting more links pointing to your website, publishing more and better content, improving the user experience on your site, and encouraging social sharing. Doing that is gonna help to increase your website's authority and make it more likely that your content will be a featured voice search result in Google. Tip number seven, make sure your website loads fast. Page speed is a ranking factor, and Brian Dean's study found that the average voice search result loaded in 4.6 seconds, and that's about half the speed of the average web page. So fast loading times, very important for ranking in voice search. If you're not sure if your page is loading fast, go to Google Page Speed Insights and you can check very quickly to see how fast your pages are loading and take steps to improve them if you need. Follow these tips and you'll be able to generate a lot more traffic to your site through voice search SEO. I know it seems like it's not popular yet. Do I really have to adopt? Trust me. Voice search SEO is going to be a lot more popular and you don't want to be the one at the end scrambling for that last extra traffic because you didn't adopt early enough. If you want to know more about voice search, we just put up a great guide that tells you everything you need to know. You can check it out in the link below.